Okay guys, it is Monday, the beginning of week 24, and I am leaving New Madrid, Missouri, and it is our last full day in Missouri. We are crossing into Kentucky today. The reason that is a big deal is because of how we're doing it. We've got to get across the biggest river in America, Mississippi, and there's no bridges in this area, and this is the fastest point to get across. We are taking a ferry boat. So we are going to the Darina Hickman Ferry, and it is a 21 mile day for us and the ferry closes at 5.30. So we have got to move because if we miss it, we are stuck camping on the banks and then the ferry is closed for the next two days. So we'd be out in the rain for the next two days on the banks of the Mississippi. So we have to make it. And uh, yeah, it's kind of imperative that I move my butt today. But yeah, it's gonna be exciting cross into state number nine, Kentucky. And uh, yeah, looking forward to it. Can't wait to get these horses on that river ferry. The other side of this field here, these woods is called Big Oak Tree State Park. I wonder why they call it that. Guys, we're off. How are your shoe legs, boys? So long, Missouri. this to top all the things I've ever done. Taking two horses across the Mississippi River on a ferry. What are we doing? This is crazy. <laughs> well guys, welcome to state number nine, Kentucky. Did it guys. Welcome to Kentucky guys. Woo! Unbridled spirit, I love it. That's a vibe I can with. All right, guys, it is Wednesday and I am leaving Hickman, Kentucky. We're gonna be headed to Fulton, Tennessee today. We're gonna be in South Fulton. So we're gonna be crossing into state number 10. So that is pretty exciting. Got the load being driven ahead today. So huge thanks to the man doing that. Also huge thanks to the Darina Hickman Ferry for our crossing and for supporting us getting across the river on Monday evening, it was a super cool experience. And uh, yeah, horses did great, we got across just fine. So yeah, we are doing good here in Kentucky. We've had a bit of rain, it looks like we're gonna get some more here throughout the rest of this week, but we're ready. All right, guys, this is the state line road between Kentucky and Tennessee. Just gonna come over here and boom, state number 10, Tennessee. We are one third through the list of states. That is pretty cool. We're gonna be staying on this Tennessee side tonight. Okay guys, it is Friday and I am in Fulton, Tennessee, South Fulton technically. We're gonna be headed back up into Kentucky today though. We're gonna be headed towards Linville in Cuba. Got us a place to stay out there. A huge thanks to the Barclays for putting us up last night. They do some pretty cool Tennessee walkers out here. And uh, they're also gonna be taking my load ahead today. So that was super nice of them. But yeah, we, had some rain this morning, but now it's cleared up. Hopefully it'll stay just like this the rest of the day. It's pretty nice. So the town of Fulton is divided into municipalities of South Fulton and Fulton. And that's because it lies right on the state line between Kentucky and Tennessee. So Tennessee has South Fulton and Kentucky just has the town of Fulton. And they gotta have their own separate court and their own separate police. and. All of that, even though it's kind of like one town, but half of it's in Tennessee and half of it's in Kentucky. 
don't know if you guys can tell. It's more noticeable when they have the red berries. But those leaves are called wintergreen. And that stuff will poison a horse so bad if they eat a bit of it. Gotta be real careful about the wintergreen bushes. All right, guys, we are now going through Fulton, Kentucky. We've just kind of been getting drizzled on the last hour. Nothing too bad. We're less than an hour out from our destination. Getting off to stretch my legs for a second. dairy with the trout family got us rolled out on some straw bales a little bit better than being on the cement yeah good deal it's probably gonna rain so I'm glad we're under this roof okay it is Saturday and today I'm headed to Murray Kentucky I'm gonna be staying at the equine center at Murray State University Huge thanks to the Trout family last night for taking good care of us. We stayed at their dairy farm. So yeah, we have a 20 mile day today and uh, rain finally slowed down a little bit. We'll see if it gets back going again, but hopefully it'll stay like this. So the Parr family yesterday took me out to Land Between the Lakes and I wanted to see one of our biggest bridge crossings of this entire trip, which is gonna be happening tomorrow. And out there at Land Between the Lakes, they've got this bison and elk preserve and got to see some of the, the bison out there just grazing next to the road. So Kentucky, big old bison out there just grazing next to the road is super cool. All right, guys, it is the end of another great week on the Year of the Mustang. I am here just east of Murray, Kentucky, and I'm staying with the Parr family. So a huge thanks to them for putting us up over the last two nights. I was able to get a little rest day in today. Also, thanks to Murray State University a couple nights ago for hooking us up with a spot in their equine center. They have an incredible horse program and a big thanks to Shay for hooking us up with that. This coming week, I'm going to be headed east across Kentucky. And we're gonna see some fantastic country and hopefully meet some more incredible people. I just wanted to introduce the theme for the month of March quick. And I got thinking about last month's theme, which was change. And I decided that I didn't want to just pass over that. I felt like there was so much more that could be gained. And I think what I wanted to emphasize specifically in the month of March was a change of heart. Um, that internal change, the, the desire to change and become something more than we are. So that is the theme for the month of March. We're kind of carrying over the theme of change and, and gonna dive even deeper into that and, and expand and hope that you can all hit that with me. So thank you guys so much for tuning into this week's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, hit that like and subscribe button, helps us out a ton. And that way you won't miss these videos that are coming out every week on the Year of the Mustang. The adventure continues on every week, so. Hope to see you guys in the next one. Until then, adios.